What's up, everybody? Welcome back to part two of our Gendry Bullrathian Let's Play, The Man with the Mighty Ho. In this episode, we will be joining House Stark. Just as Lord Eddard had intended, we will fight alongside his son, Rob, to reclaim peace for the Iron Throne. Until I find out who you are, anyway. It dude doesn't even know who we are. Sir, we are Gendry, and we have one hell of a hoe. Alright, I'd like to discuss something. I'd like to enter your service as a mercenary. Yes, well, we do hire mercenaries, and some of them, I'll admit, are men of honor. Your reward will be 140 gold for every group of ven enemies you vanquish, or for an equivalent deed. I accept. You can count on me, my lord. Alright, here we go. We've officially joined the Starks. Let's pick up some Stark levies, some soldiers here. White Harbor Squires are nice, but they're not really preferable. It's not really what I want to have in my army, to be honest. Um, Winterfell, Winterfell, let me click on you so I can go into the city and recruit some dudes. Alrighty. Grab this, 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 this. Oh, we're at war with House Lannister. Very nice. Do like some Lannister battles. Is there an army formed up somewhere? Anyone we can join? Total strength. We're about equal with the Lannisters as far as strength goes. We need some more food. So we're going to come over here to this little grain village while we recruit some more peasantry to join our force. We have some... Uh, gear to sell and some stuff to smelt, so we'll get into that as well. <clears throat> as Gendry is a famous blacksmith, we need to make sure the man maintains his stature. We'll get up to about 30 food. That's 15 days of food. Of food. Um, let's head over to back to Winterfell. Um, we'll get cheaper wood here because of the local town Acorn Water, giving us more lumber in the area, so... Do we already have lumber? We do. Nice. Alright, so we'll go into the smithy. And we're going to smelt smelt some stuff. Get some more charcoal. Just smelt some stuff down. Very nice. <clears throat> Alrighty. Alrighty then. Lord Rob, when will we be attacking? I wish to join you in crushing some Lannister heads with my brilliant hoe. Alright, well, we'll go for a walk. We'll see if we can find some uh, knights or bandits or something to deal with. There are some forest bandits over here. That could be a good little spot to raid. Let's have a look around. See if there's any missions nearby. Four broken men. Ah, the ta how the turns have tabled. Remember when you chased me? Ha 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 ha. Not anymore, fool. Mountain raiders. Attacking some local peasants. We should help. Gendry will not stand by while raiders pillage villages. Men, assault! I will lead you into battle with my mighty hoe. See, this peasant gets it. He's got his he's got his mighty hoe ready. The enemy does have one horseman. I'm not really worried about that. We do have a bit of a line of spears here. It is a javy horseman, but again, not overly concerned. Let's go, boys. My athletic skill is a little bit better than my infantry, so I'm just kind of taken off down this hill. Meow. Ah, Lord Gendry, fiercest of the Bullrathians. If you guys weren't aware, we are the Bullrathian instead of the Barathian, because, well, uh, you can't steal the name of a house. Fuck, what the fuck? What? Fuck! Bam! Come on, let me cleave something off. Let me get some cleave in here. Ah. Oh. Well, they have only their horseman dude left. Let's get up here, boys. Gotta wait for him to waste all of his uh, javelins. Ah. Have you ever, ever felt like this? Meh, 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 meh. Strange things happen. Here you going. Round the twist. Dude's running away. Look at this coward. Come back here and face me. Fight me, almighty fighter. Nope, nope, nope. What are you doing, sir? I wish to face you in battle. Come here. 
Alright, you know what? Infantry. Form up right there. He will turn to us. Let the peasants charge him. We will hold our formation. Infantry! Move! That's it, peasants. You got this. Hey, look, an arm did come off. The limbs of the fallen. Men, shield wall. Charge. There we go. That'll deal with him. You weren't ready for that, were you, buddy? Excellent. No losses in our group. <laughs> Very nice. We do have prisoners with us that we can sell, which is great. Get some northern heroes. Some more Stark footmen. I'm not really keen on going for much uh, archers in this run. We don't really need them that much. Uh, we're going to go, I think... We'll go over here to White Harbor and sell off our prisoners. Oh, Grey Edge. They have a mission. We'll check out this mission first. All right, there's got to be enemies around here. Oh, I may have to abandon this mission. Rob Stark's just uh, committed to doing a thing. He's made an army. All right, no, we're going to join good old Rob. The King of the North. We will fight by his side. Hoe in hand. We fear no man. Sorry, buddy, I'm abandoning your quest. I, I have better things to do, like joining the army of Winterfell. It's a far better goal. I'm sorry. I'm out. Got stuff to do. Whoa, that's a lot of dudes. Hello there. Oh my lord. Okay, this may or may not be a good plan. There's 53 bandits against 44 of us. <clears throat> We're on a bridge, so we could get a bridge battle. No, no. The, the map has decided that we do not get a bridge. That's, um... That's sad. I wanted to have a bridge battle. They've taken that away from me. Now, the enemy will charge us. We could make a bit of a choke point over here. Let's do that. Infantry with me. Make the enemy come through this very small area. We have spearmen. We have shields. We can hold this quite effectively. <clears throat> they may be bandits, but they do have more men than us, so... It is smarter for us to hunker down and hold this position. Soldiers, to the front! Peasants, defend the rear! Warriors, shield wall! Come get some, peasant. We're gonna mess these guys up. Yeah, that's right, we're over here. Come get some. Alright, boys, move in. We fight them in this area. Right, let's cleave some boys. Hoe in hand. That man just lost a leg. Oh god. Yeah, you want some? You don't know the power of the hoe. Ah, oh, there goes his hand. That's it, boys. Push him back. Carve him up. Into a nice juicy mutton chop. Oh, the arm! The dismemberment! It's beautiful! You cannot face me. I have a hoe! Another arm gone. Oh my god, there goes that man's leg. Oh dear lord. Oh my god, the slow mo kill scenes. Holy damn, this is the greatest warrior in the Seven Kingdoms. Oh god, oh god, okay, maybe not the greatest, but definitely, you know, he's definitely good. <laughs> Alright, let's fast forward and wrap up these bandits. They don't really have a chance against our full force. Na -na 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 -na. Get them, boys. Oh, they surrendered. Nice. Alright, we've got five dead, three wounded. Our dead men are mostly recruits, one Stark Levy and a Stark Soldier. So mostly our frontline units. 20 prisoners. Excellent. Get some more Stark Soldiers. Get a Northern Warlord. Why not? Our Northern recruits can now level up. Well, I think all of them can, which is awesome. We've actually got some infantry to commit to this upcoming war. And we absolutely smashed an entire army of raiders. Speaking of which, look, another army of raiders! No. What have you 
Ah, that's 68 against 36. They have doubled our numbers. Um, we can't actually fight this. Can we try to get away? Uh, we may lose as many as 12 soldiers. Continue. Run, 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 run. Hello, Lord Stark. I only lost a couple men on the way here. Alright, we'll grab some more recruits. Pad out our army. We were too injured to fight that. If we, um, if we ourselves weren't injured, I think we could have won that battle. Hands down, it wouldn't have been a problem. Gendry lost his daring trait because we ran. That's unfortunate. But hey, sometimes it's better to be smart than brave. Alright, let's join up with good old Rob Stark. We're here, Rob. Actually, we should buy food. This is about to be a very, very intense march south, I believe. Alright, we're gonna... Grab some more mules for the journey. Ca to carry any loot we may pick up. We're gonna sell off all of that armor. Sell off this stuff. Hold on to this, because we can smelt all of that. We should probably check if we can smelt some of it down now, actually. Unlock that. Unlock it, unlock it. Alright, um, pick up some more food supplies. Yes, 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 I know I'm spending most of the money I have, but it's kind of necessary. Alright, that should do us for now. Now we want to go... Uh, we've already got... Oh no, we don't have max units. There we go, that's alright. Now, smithy. To the smithy! And we don't have enough stamina for that, so let's just go and join the Stark army. Oh, what a force. Building up a large army. There's going to be about 1,500, 1,600 Starks in this army. Hopefully they do something. Alright guys, I will be back in just a moment once the full force has gathered. <clears throat> Alright, we're back in. The army disbanded from a lack of cohesion. So that's a thing. <laughs> I'm now running this way. Try and find something to do. We see an army actually on the march. We will join them. I imagine Moat Kaelin will soon come under siege. It's still northern at the moment. There is a tournament at White Harbor. Let us compete. Alright. To the arena. Armored bearskin for the victor. Excellent. Excellent. Have some drank. I think this is a very unfair fight. Gendry against recruits. Please, you mock my skill. One down. Bring it on. Go for the epic. Jump. Get out of here. That guy took a bit of a beating for a recruit. I'll give him that. Didn't land a hit, but he took a beating. Alright, let's go. How come you get the two-handed sword, sir? I'm not okay with this. I want that sword. I want this sword. Ha ah, sword. Give me that. Yes! Far superior. Gendry is ready. I mean, I've, I really should be working on my axe, but... It's fine. It's two-handed skill, regardless. Bring it on, buddy. We're going to take this guy down. I kill people with a hoe. An axe is no change for me. Oh, God, I missed. That was almost terrible. Yeah. Got his ass. He out of here. All right. Next round, final round. Let's go. Once we get some better armor, the uh, tournament tier will increase, which will be good for us. Oh, one shot and he's down. We are, our two-handed skill is now at 85. Our athletics is 76. We are going to become quite the intimidating warrior on foot. Alright. Uh, we're going to wait here for some time just to get our smithing back. So we can smelt down some gear. Uh, da -da 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 whoa, 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 whoa. What was that? Oh, no. We missed it. <coughs> we missed it. There was an event. No. Aw. That was one of the new script events. 
Well, that sucks. Um, that was to do with uh, Melisandre influencing Stannis, I believe. <clears throat> so that has begun. The plot to kill Renly Baratheon has begun. It's alright. Didn't much like Uncle Renly anyway. Stannis is more of a Gendry type of guy, you know. Uh, plus five experience to infantry in your party for each enemy you kill with a two-handed weapon. Well, that sounds like something useful. Let's do that. Increase our athletics even further. We'll upgrade our endurance more for smithing. Um, plus five party size, 30% persuasion, crafting stamina. Yes, we want that. All right. Now to smelt all of the things. Nice. Ooh. Give us some more of this. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, not enough yet. We wait. We wait, we wait, we wait. We'll soon smith our first weapon. The time has almost come. I don't believe an army is being made anywhere, and if there is, I don't know if they're really interested in doing anything until the Lannisters actually show up in the north. <coughs> the Waddies of the north don't seem too interested in leaving the north, which I suppose makes sense. If we look at uh, northern history, they don't do too well when they leave. Alright, let's go to the smithy. Let's see if we can forge something. We've got some materials. We, any Thamaskine steel we get, we have to hold on to, because that will allow us to forge our better weapon. Um, Alright, we want to make, let's see, two-handed axe. We can try to make a better hoe than the one we have. That's a thing. We're unlocking, like, the pommels for the axes, which is kind of... Kind of not very effective, but it's fine. Um, yeah, well, well, that's it. We're just going to make a hoe. All right, here we go. Hoe being made. Make it super long. Give it a ring pommel. Make it all fancy. And we'll forge. We don't have enough materials? Oh, we don't have enough charcoal. Hold on. I will craft more of these. Oh, I didn't want to smelt it. I wanted to craft more of them. Try and increase our smithing skills even further. <laughs> Let's have a look at our, our weapons and see if we have a better one. Did we manage to craft a better one? We did not. Nothing is better than our well-made hoe. All right. Well, we'll sell these then. Quick 380 gold. All right. Let's go. Oh, bandits are attacking the villagers. Gendry will not stand for this. We will kill them with overwhelming force. Send 50 men to kill like 8 bandits. Let's go. Not even. 5 bandits. It's absolutely pouring rain right now. Our men are very slow moving. And they are archers. They're forest bandits. So they might actually manage to kill a few of my men. Ooh, there's a mule over here. I'm going to ride this mule into battle. Gendry Bullrathian, Mule Rider. The most intimidating of men. Mule, come here. Excellent. I am ready for battle. Yeah. Yeah. Bring it on. I'm going to get shot off this thing, aren't I? Woohoo. Not even close. That guy on the right's aiming at me. No one else is aiming at me. Just the guy on the right. Might hit me. Oh, he missed. The rain's absolutely ruining him. You shot my mule. That's not okay. This is the the mount of a king. You will not shoot my ho my mule again. Ah, fear me and me mighty hoe. Oh, me no mule. He's almost dead. Yeah, got him. This random northern recruit's the only guy that made it to the ba to the battle. Get him, buddy. Use that big hammer. I'm pretty sure that guy just got killed by a rock thrown by a peasant. Very nice. We didn't even need to help them. They did all the work, aside from me riding around on a mule. We have 25 prisoners we need to get rid of. To the Dread Fort. The only place where you should ever sell prisoners. Because we know they'll be well looked after there. Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? Ooh, ooh, ooh! Come here! Eighteen bandits! I have to take them out. If I'm actually fast enough to catch them, I'll be shocked. I don't think I am. 
There is a um, robber knight hideout here. <laughs> oh well, we gotta sell our prisoners. It's fine. <clears throat> hey you! Come this way. Come here, someone will cut him off. Surely. Surely. Nope. Yeah, okay, we, we just sell our prisoners at White Harp. We're too slow to catch anybody. <clears throat> That's what happens when you gotta care for prisoners the whole time. Alright. <clears throat> sell the... <clears throat> Throat's all clogged up. Alright, we'll sell those. Then we shall ride out. This guy's a hell of a garrison. 800 men in here. <laughs> I think we're actually going to head this way and see if we can go find some Lannisters to kill. It might be a bit overly gutsy, to be totally honest, because, well, we have mostly peasants in our army. <clears throat> Hold on! Mace Tyrell of the Reach has declared war on the north. What a jerk! Come on, Tyrell, we used to be friends. Well, I'm going to ride this way and sort of just wait and see if I can find any... Uh... Oh! A Shadow's Deed. A messenger approaches your party, his face pale and voice trembling. My lord, I bear dark tidings, he stammers. Renly Baratheon has been slain in his camp by a shadowy wraith. The whispers claim that the wraith bore the visage of Stannis himself. In the wake of this tragedy, Renly's bannermen have pledged their fealty to Stannis, who now controls Storm's End. The turn of events leaves you pondering your next move. Stannis's newfound power could make him a valuable ally, or it could be used against you, should his ambitions go unchecked. Will you hold Stannis accountable for his actions, or join forces with him to seize the opportunities this new alliance may offer? Ooh! Interesting! The Stormlands are no more. So did... Did he actually just inherit all of that? We're, like, very, very slowly capturing... Catching these broken men down here. Alright, we'll fight these guys, and then we'll go investigate that. We'll go have a look. That's really cool. They literally scripted in Renly getting murdered by Melisandre. And Stannis. I mean, we can blame Stannis all we want, but he can't conjure magic. Definitely was Melisandre's fault, technically. Was a hundred percent her plan. All right, let's mess up these broken men, lads. Some of our party men need some experience before we go fighting Lannisters. Good axe throwing. I'm gonna cleave this man. Your shield means nothing if I take your arm off. Oh, and again. Oh my god. Massacring the boys. Victory, lads. The greatest hunting party ever sent by the North. Alright, we got some level ups to go with. Get some more Stark levies in here. I don't want the prisoners, they're just going to slow me down. Alright, let's go have a look. So, over here, Dragonstone, owned by Stannis. Stone Dance is the Westerlands, but it's owned by, it's originally Stannis's. Celtigar Keep, Stannis, Evanfall, Storm, uh, yep, Dragonstone. Um, that's held by the Reach, Dragonstone, Griffin's Roost is the Reach, Dawn owns this area, um, Weeping Town, Dragonstone, so the mass expansion that Dragonstone just had could actually give them the potential power to beat back, um, Tywin Lannister and Mace Tyrell, where normally they struggle with that. Interesting. Um, let's have a quick look at the diplomacy right now. So, what is diplomacy like currently? So, the Reach is at war... At war with... Um, us, the Iron Islands, the Stormlands, Dragonstone, the Riverlands. Alright, let's have a look at the Dragonstone 
uh, diplomacy. They are at war with the Stormlands, Westerlands, and the Reach. Well, they can't really be at war with the Stormlands, because they don't exist anymore, so... Very nicely done. Gotta say, not a bad move from the uh, Lannisters. Well, from, not from the Lannisters. From the Dragonstone Warriors, and from Melisandre and Stannis. As underhanded as his tactics are, it definitely was a good strategy. Let's go ride and see what we can find. Look for an army to maybe pick off. And by army, I mean small group, because we aren't going to stand a chance against an actual Lannister army. I'm trying to ride along here, see if we can pick someone off around Iron Bay. Or if we can raid Iron Bay and then leave. So far, no enemies. Out of the trade. Uh, Benefort Party, 19. All right, well, we're going to raid Bane Village. Uh, take hostile action, raid village. They have 69 men, but they are militia. Let's do this. I have faith in our men's abilities to raid this area. Why am I way back here? This doesn't seem right. What are yours? The enemy has us outnumbered. But it is... We have more infantry than they do. They have more archers because we don't have any. So this entire battle relies on us using our shield wall to push forward and overwhelm their infantry so that we can get on top of their archery group. Shield wall. Go forward. We must support our advancing warriors. The rain should help us out with their archers. Couple that with sort of going inside the woods here. Actually, could we maneuver... They're quite far away. There's a chance we go um, line formation. Have our boys follow us and try and get inside the town. That should nullify their archers almost entirely. Come on, boys. Quickly, across the field. I will plow the field. Ah, yes. Where I was meant to be with my weapon. Instead, I'm cleaving off heads. And arms. And legs. Many dead guys. Ah, boys with me. Come on. Hurry up. Hurry up. The enemy will, at one point, be in range of us. We need to make sure that we nullify that range. If I had a bow, I could antagonize them into coming to us, but I do not. Gendry needs no bow. He is a man of running at people and hitting them very hard. Very simple needs. Alrighty. This is a nice little village. I like this village. Cool little details in it. Little, little chair. We can sit down by the pond. Very tranquil. Very nice. The enemy archers are over there, so are their infantry. Oh, very nice. Look, we're just going to sit here and wait for our boys to catch up, alright? Come on, lads. Hurry up. You can do it. I know you can. Ah. Uh, he's like, what's behind me? What is it? Something there? Stannis? Melisandre? Randley? Ah, uh -huh, no, he's dead. Ah. Uh, alright, our boys are catching up. Very, very nice. Uh, come on, lads. I know it's raining, but you you got to put in a better effort than that. All right, doing this little uh, reach-around technique, <laughs> we're going to end up behind this hill, which should give us perfect cover to advance. Oh, Jesus, the rain making us so slow. Right, infantry, infantry. I want you to form up here. Move. Yeah, going around that way was not the play, guys. I mean, you're going to get through there quicker, I guess, but you're also able to be shot at from there. <laughs> I 
The enemy are about 140 meters away. Alright, lads, with me. After me. We move, keep moving along using this small ridge as a bit of cover. Might be able to move up onto the high ground, circle around behind them, and then charge them. <clears throat> we must remove their ability to use archers. Mostly because we're raiding this village and need to try and maintain... Oh, we can't even get behind them. Alright, well, man. Form up. Shields. Shields up. Push Attack. forward. Shields at the ready. March. Excellent. Keep your shields up. You be careful there, Mr. Northern Recruit. You're not really capable of taking an arrow to the face. Same as me. You gotta chill. Our northern warlords might be able to even the scales a bit with just our veterancy. We have some Stark House guards to help us... help us chop through the enemy line. Once we get closer, we'll reform. Make sure our line's actually thick again, which will allow our dudes like this guy to throw his axes easier. Shields! Up! The enemy's advancing. Form up. Let them come to us. If they want to advance on us, that's perfect. They have to cross this stream. We're in a perfect position to hold. That's it, lads. Hold! They're like charging us with a wedge formation. Push! Ow! Spear guy. Ow! Longer range than I have. One down. Break that man's shield. Oh god, I fell. I'm drowning in the river. Hold formation, lads. Push them back. One knocks down. Shield out. Another one down. Another one down. Whoa, cleave that man's arm off. They get their spearmen because they're getting more range on us. This little ridge is kind of serving very nicely for us. Ow, spearmen! Oh, we're so close to death. We got to be careful here. That's it, lads. Hold your ground. Die, damn it! You are dead. Come on, boys. Push. Oh, God. They were coming at me. Woo! Glitching out a bit. We're good. Another one down. Oh. Yes. Take advantage of him. We're pushing him back. They still have a lot of archers back there we've got to be careful of. Need to maintain our position. I'm going to pick up this shield. Man with me.
That's it, lads. Oh, I'm down. Come on, boys. Push through. Holy damn. All right, once they're down, maybe we got this. Nope, our men just broke. All right, end the battle. <clears throat> Before it counts as a loss, we're just going to retreat. <laughs> okay, that went very poorly. Apparently, we were not ready to raid a village. That is unfortunate. I thought that the terrain there would work for us. It did not. Let us move on out. Got to go replenish our forces. Jesus. We got spanked. Um, I really don't want to fight bandits right now. That would be really bad for us. Would not end well. Ride through the town over here. Nope. Go away, forest bandits. Nope. Go away, forest... Nope. Don't do it. <clears throat> All right. To puddle and fast fog. Yeah? What is it now? All right, boys. We could not find um, what I wanted to find, but we found some Skagosi, and we're going to go hunting Sk Skagosi to get to our next clan tier. <laughs> I am excited for this. All right. Let's hunt us some bandits. They're a little bit stronger than normal bandits. We're going to shield wall up. We're going to play the defensive game. Man, I want a nice wide shield wall. Got our nice stark levies. See, the levies are actually repping our shields, whereas the uh, normal house guards aren't. Obviously, so I think we might end up going for like the more uh, northern warriors as opposed to Stark warriors because that'll get, let us actually show off our own banners. The enemy is coming to us just very, very slowly. I think we're like too far up. They're going to end up overwhelming our left flank. want to sort of even out with them. That's it, man. Bring it forward. Bring the line down and forward. Nice and steady. Enemy are about 100 meters out. Commit forward. 34 of them against 43 of us. Or 46 of us, actually. We win this. We have our new sword. The cleaving dudes up. Should be able to get some good damage with this thing. They're also in a shield wall. They have javelins. Be careful. Keep your shields ready. They're absolutely horrible at aiming them because they're in a snowstorm. This blizzard's working out incredibly well for us. Right, men. Commit to the battle. Oh, ho, ho. there goes the man's arm. That's it, lads. Break through them. Oh, 
Whoa, taking off the arms. We've broken them, lads. Chase them down. Alright, this will be our last battle of this episode, I think. Next episode, we're going to spam hunt some Skagosi warriors. Get some epic slow-mo murder scenes here. Come here, you. Take off the arms. Looks like their better units are getting away, but their weaker ones are a bit slow. Hey, buddy, you're a bit slow. Your friends are gone. And so is your head. Victory. Alright, guys, if you're enjoying this new content, drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe if you're new here. Um, try to drop a comment and tell me what what your favorite possible path for Gendry is. Whether that's joining the Night's Watch, forming our own brotherhood without banners, or defeating... Stannis and claiming our position as the greatest of the Ball Rathians. Alright guys, bye for now, not forever.